In case you missed it, here are some highlights of discussions and actions taken at Monday night's County Council meeting held at St. Helena Branch Library. First, local Montfort Marines led the meeting in the Pledge of Allegiance and Prayer. The Council then recognized members to mark the 80th anniversary of the first Black Marine Basic Training Group. Their unit fought in the Pacific at the Battle of Okinawa even while facing discrimination at home. As part of his administrator's report, Eric Greenway continues to recognize county employees for the great work they do. Employees are nominated by their department heads. There were a number of public hearings and second readings, zoning map amendments, community development code text amendments for Ladies Island Community Preservation and Development, and short-term rentals as special use. Other agenda items included final readings of the ARPA fund expenditures in the budget, approval of the A-tax and H-tax funds, rezoning rural and critical land properties, approval of Parks and Rec pursuing a $300,000 grant from SC Parks, Rec, and Tourism, as well as approval of a resolution for the Hilton Head Island Airport Terminal Financing Plan. Finally, Council voted 9-2 to pass the resolution on the US-278 Corridor Traffic Improvement Project for the Town of Hilton Head. The municipality now has 30 days to respond and begin their commitment toward completing the project. These are just the highlights from the Council meeting. To watch the full meeting, visit www.bufortcountysc.gov and click on the County Channel.